all aboard the spaceship. Next stop, Planet Nine. Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 Tammy Brown moments on RuPaul's Drag Race. You want it crazy, well you got it now. For this list, we're taking a look at the moments from season one of RuPaul's Drag Race and season one of RuPaul's Drag Race All-Stars that made us fall in love with this kooky and iconic queen. Let's dive in. Number 10, crazy sticks to me like ribs. Hey Tammy. Hey there RuPaul. All right, now you're quirky, I love it. People love it. Are you like this 24 hours a day? Tammy has always been known as a high concept character, which is why this iconic line came as a surprise to absolutely nobody. After being cut from the competition early on, audiences and Rue were itching to see more of Tammy in season one's reunion episode and find out whether she'd be just as eccentric and kooky outside of the competition. Rue asked Tammy whether she's this quirky 24 7, to which Tammy replied that she's been called crazy ever since seventh grade and that crazy sticks to her like ribs. Well, case closed, we guess. In seventh grade, they say, You're crazy. I said, Okay, I like that. Crazy sticks to me. Uh huh. Like ribs. Number nine, I'm Tammy Brown and I'm gonna spin your head round and round. She's the Drag Race Nation's sweetheart, but Tammy showed she could get sassy too in this hilarious All Stars one moment. The judges weren't impressed with Tammy's performance in the second episode's comedy challenge. Tammy wasn't afraid to stand up for herself, however, declaring, I'm Tammy Brown, and I'm gonna spin your head round and round. <laughs> in Untucked, she revealed that she even read Michelle to filth during judging, commenting on the makeup line she'd left on her neck. I'm being read right in front of my You're eyes. I'm being read. If I was gonna read, I can talk about that line on someone's neck. If that doesn't make Tammy one of the bravest and boldest queens to grace the main stage, we do not know what will. And then Michelle got all mad. That was kind of spooky, you know? Number eight, if you want to eat shrimps butt naked, that's your business. Tammy Brown is kooky. That's just sad. She's crazy. Category is nonsensical encouragement. And in this category, Tammy definitely took home the crown. Despite her short run on All Stars 1, viewers loved seeing Tammy's workroom banter with the other queens, especially in this iconic moment with Latrice Royale. Seemingly out of nowhere, Tammy called Latrice over in the workroom and told her with a totally deadpan expression that if she wants to sit around and eat shrimps butt naked, then that's her business. Hey, Latrice, if you want to sit around and eat shrimps butt naked, that's your business. It's this kind of workroom buffoonery that we live for from Tammy. And so another nugget of gold was added to the endless list of Tammyisms we know and love. Number seven, Tammy's performance in the joke wall. Yes? <laughs> what is it, my joke? Yes. Yeah. It may be the performance that got her sent home on All Stars 1, but it was still as iconic as we'd expect from this out of this world queen. <gasps> The girls were asked to impersonate celebrities, just like in the series Snatch Game episode, and come up with some comic material to share in a laugh-in style joke wall. Tammy attempted to impersonate Christian singer and evangelist Tammy Faye Messner, but ended up just giving us pure Tammy Brown energy, even screaming Tootsie Lou as one of her punchlines. Lupe, peekaboo. Pika who? Tootsie Lou. Although the judges were not impressed, audiences were just happy to get more content from the Tammy we know and love. Miss Lupe. What's up? Victoria Parker or Miss Piggy. Honk, honk. Number six, smell her butt, smell her butt. Part of the Tammy Brown charm is that no one knows what nonsense she's gonna come out with next, which was demonstrated most perfectly in this classic All Stars One moment. Hanging out in the workroom, Tammy decided to dress up as a San Francisco style queen, flouncing around in her pink frilly dress and blonde wig. All of those San Francisco queens, I look like them. Then supposedly out of nowhere and to nobody in particular, Tammy says, ooh, smell her butt, smell her butt, she's like a cat, confusing the rest of the cast and gracing us with another iconic quote from the show. Service, ooh, smell her butt, smell her butt, she's like a cat. It's lines like this that leave us wishing we had more time with Tammy during her seasons. Number five, I'm on planet nine. Tammy, at awkward, spontaneous times, says the things where I have no clue where she comes up with. Thank you, I'm coming, my little African cherry. A lot of viewers agree that when Tammy appeared on Drag Race, she was a queen way ahead of her time. So audiences were not surprised to find out that she was actually from another planet altogether. What we did not expect was that the planet was just the old classic Planet Nine. 
In a confessional, Tammy discussed why the other queens were confused by her personality, and that she doesn't really know where all the confusion comes from. Apparently, the answer is simple. She's on Planet 9, whilst the rest of the queens are on Planet 3. Of course that's what it is. I don't know where the confusion comes from. I'm just a different person from everybody else, and I'm on Planet 9, they're on Planet 3. Number 4. I can get Jiggy and Wiggy. This one's yours. This one's mine. See, it's very short, isn't it? It is short, but sometimes I can get short too. People don't know that. Watching the queens interact and connect with Rue in the workroom is one of the best things about RuPaul's Drag Race, especially when those queens are as eccentric and hilarious as Tammy Brown. Upon inspecting Tammy's short and sexy dress that she'd created for the girl group challenge, Rue asked Tammy whether she can get Jiggy, to which Tammy went one further and said that she can get Jiggy and Wiggy. Can you get Jiggy? I can get Jiggy. Okay. I can get Jiggy and Wiggy. It's not often that Rue is totally nonplussed by the queens, but this line made him admit that he was scared of her. We knew you were special, Tammy. Okay, all right. That's right. I'm scared of you. Number three, see you later in the magazines. Good luck. Thank you. Now sashay away. The exit lines from the queens on RuPaul's Drag Race have always provided us with some fantastic quotables, and Tammy Brown's exit line was no exception. Sadly, Tammy didn't last long on season one of RuPaul's Drag Race and was eliminated after she failed to perform in the girl group challenge. And it was just it's disappointing to see you give up like that. She more than made up for this, however, with her hilarious attitude upon her departure. Buenas noches, she exclaimed whilst twirling around, before gifting us with the line, see you later in the magazines, together with the classic Tammy head tilt. If this didn't leave audiences wanting more, we don't know what would have. Buenas noches. Bye, Tammy. Bye, Tammy. Oh, see you later in the magazines. <laughs> Number two, come on, Teletubby, teleport us to Mars. Whilst All Stars 1 was arguably disappointing overall, it graced us with one of the best untucked episodes ever, and Tammy had a huge part to play. The queens were discussing their places in the competition, in particular that of controversial contact sport queen Mimi I'm First. Tammy provided comic relief in her bizarre Tammy way, singing at Mimi to change your costume, change it around. Change your costume, Girl. Mimi. Change your costume, change it around. And exclaiming, ah, ah, I'm acting. Apparently out of nowhere. Ha! Ha! I'm acting. Manila was aghast by Mimi's attitude and said she should have known what she was getting herself into. Before Tammy shrieked, well, come on, Teletubby, teleport us to Mars. A line made more ridiculous by the fact that the Teletubbies have nothing to do with space or teleportation. We stan. Oh, well, come on, Teletubby, teleport us to Mars. What the f is is this bitch for real? Before we unveil our number one Tammy Brown pick, here are some honorable mentions. We have to sniff the flowers. <laughs> She likes to wear grass. Grass underwear? Grass underwear, because it's always green. Oh, there's a pumpkin in my tub. Tammy Brown is nuts. The way their hands smelt like trash. I cured my grandmother! I would love one day to march to the beat of Tammy's drum, just for one day. Sexy orangutan, shake it and do your thing. OK. Who are your influences? My influences, first of all, started with Tina Turner. Uh-huh. You like Tina Turner? Because I like her, too. She has long legs and nice weeks. And I really like that, and I aspire for that high life condition. That's what got me moving in drag was Tina Turner. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number one, excuse your mouth. I don't see you out there walking children in nature. Tammy's performance in season one's reunion episode might just be one of the bravest drag race moves we've ever seen. After Tammy told the judges that negativity just brings the queens down, Rue went into a passionate, expletive-filled monologue about how queens have to remember who they are, which Tammy met with the classic comeback, excuse your mouth. It's your responsibility. Excuse your mouth. Tammy then told the judges that calling her a loser was unfair and that she doesn't see them out there walking children in nature. Yes, you both call me losers. And I don't see you out there walking children in nature. And quintessentially Tammy, but still logically sound enough to make a point, this line has gone down as one of the most loved drag race quotes of all time, and has even inspired Tammy to create a hit song, which absolutely slaps if you ask us. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from Ms. Mojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.